my 2017 Project Life album. This is my hybrid layout for week 31. So this is the layout as I have created it in Photoshop CC. I'm using a collection from On a Whimsical Adventure called Catching Waves. And so what I've done with this digital collection is I've created sort of my own template. It's pretty much a design A template. I've, I've brought the margins very close together and made it slightly smaller than a typical design A template so that more of the pattern paper would show around the edges. And then I've created several journaling cards and filler cards of my own using the digital papers and the digital elements in the kit itself. And so once I have that created in Photoshop, then I print it here at home using my Canon wide format printer. I use Staples brand matte photo paper on 13 by 19 size and then cut it down to 12 by 12. So once it is printed, then I lay the, the spread out and I kind of go through my stash and look and see what kind of products I have that I want to use with the layout. I felt kind of like this layout needed some wood grain pieces maybe to emphasize the sort of beach feel. Now this isn't a layout about going to the beach. This is a summer layout. Um, and so what happened during this week, some of the stories were we spent some time at the pool. Natalie had her birthday, so we celebrated her birthday that week. She turned 10, and then we also took the kids to a, a, um, there's a local kind of gaming amusement park kind of thing called Celebration Station. It's in Greensboro, North Carolina. And so we wanted to take them for the midnight go-kart rides is what we wanted to do. So we did that and um, we also discovered a new grocery store called Lidl, L-I-D-L. It's a German grocery store and um, so I'm kind of excited about that. I, I have roots and ties to Germany from living there as a kid. So that was particularly fun. And so those are the stories from that week. Just a very typical summer kind of layout. So I used the blues and the coral colors in the kit. And then for physical supplies, I used a lot of LA Studio here the camera wood grain, the acrylic hearts, and that acrylic sunshine are both, are all Ellie Studio. The wood grain and joy word on the lower right hand corner, I actually don't know exactly where that's from. It may be an older Gossamer Blue piece from like two years ago. I don't know. Um, I'm also using my Becky Higgins roller stamp for the lines for my journaling. Um, and archival ink, pretty low on embellishments here. I wanted to keep this very simple. The layout itself has a lot of rich colors and a lot of textures in the papers themselves. It's something that on a whimsical adventure does really beautifully all of these amazing textures um, one of the textures that I was most fond of in that kit was there's one that's like a sand texture and you can see it on that blue journaling card I, I, I used it on the corners of that card just to add a little bit of visual interest there and I love it it almost looks like copper and that was just added in Photoshop, just layered on top of the patterned paper. This stamp set that I'm working with here is from Gossamer Blue. It's one of the stamp sets that's part of the Life Pages kit. 
those are of course now discontinued um, but of course I'm adding a few little stamp sentiments here and there around the page and I wanted to repeat those hearts I felt like those acrylic hearts really tied in beautifully with the colors and they add a little bit of dimension so I kind of was working a little bit with this enjoy trying to figure out how I wanted to to layer it on this card if I wanted to stamp along with it and so I ended up using these these little um, the hearts in a row and I'm going to stamp a line there for that enjoy to sit on there that gives it a little more presence there on that card I had a little tiny bit of adhesive somehow that had gotten stuck on that card so I just used that little picker thing <laughs> whatever those things are called and then my um, roller stamp here again to add lines and write a little bit of journaling also if you notice the top the top center journaling card there with the mermaid quote that is one of the the layering elements in the digital kit and it's just over top of one of the solids from the kit as well and I think this layout is just about done here just a couple of more things that I'm adding I hope that you will like and comment and subscribe thank you for watching and I'll see you back here again soon bye bye